Hi, this is Noma Dimitri in bad need of a haircut as you see. My hair doesn't seem to want to go to any direction whatsoever, especially in this humidity. But I'm not here to talk about my hair, I'm here to talk about something completely different. If you're a wine lover or a champagne lover, this tree is really important to you. And in fact, you have touched the product of this tree many, many different times. Look at how beautiful it is. It just kind of goes all the way down there towards the light where the river is and the harbor opening. Um, why is this tree important and what is it? This is the tree out of which cork is made. So the thing that you used to stopper your wine and champagne bottles is actually the bark of this tree. It's a type of oak, it's the cork oak, and most of it comes from this particular country, um, Portugal, um, which is harvested very sustainably, it's environmentally friendly. And what you see here when I go very, very close is you see the familiar look of the cork. What they do to get this is they scrape it, they have a scraper, it's a very old industry because it's a very important material in so many ways, not just for corks of bottles, but also for things that float in the water because it floats. It's also impermeable, as you know, if it was, if it was permeable, then it would suck up all the wine and it would get mushroomy and horrible. So it's impermeable, it floats, um, it's an isolating material and it's used increasingly for floors and for other reasons. So cork is great, this is the tree, this is the bark and the way it's done is something, it comes here, it scrapes this outer layer which is the dead layer, making sure to preserve the integrity of the tree inside and then the material is processed to turn it into whatever we want cork for. So I just want to show you this and a little bit more of a view of how beautiful this tree looks. It has a traditional shape of, a, of an oak tree, but the bark aspect is completely different as you can see all over here. The light is not that bad, so you can just kind of see. Anyways, just want to share this with you. I just ran into it by accident in a garden in Porto. Noma Dimitri from Portugal. Take care.